Well, by the start of the new year, 700,000 barrels of crude oil could be flowing through Trans-Canada's Gulf Coast pipeline from Cushing to Gulf Coast refineries. Now, the Gulf Coast pipeline is often confused with Trans-Canada's Keystone XL pipeline, which is still pending approval by the president. In 2012, President Barack Obama visited Cushing and urged construction of the pipeline's 485-mile southern portion from Cushing to Port Arthur, Texas, but has yet to give his okay for the pipeline to cross the U.S.-Canada border. Now, Obama faces pressure from several environmental groups to either deny or continue studying the pipeline's environmental impact. Now, earlier this month, a federal court in Denver upheld a lower court's ruling that refused to stop construction because of those environmental concerns.